All right, uh, joining me tonight in uh, Reality Check, let's start off with Dr. Niranjan Haranandani. He's president of Naredco, which is the uh, Real Estate Developers uh, Association and also Asocham Chambers of Industry. And of course, is a big realty player himself uh, in Mumbai and uh, elsewhere. Thank you for joining us. Uh, also, we have with us Rituparna Chakraborty, co-founder and executive vice president, Teamly Services, uh, which is a job placement uh, company, and uh, DP Kaushik, Spokesperson BJP Haryana is also with us. Uh, let me just start with you, uh, Rituparna, about your thoughts on this uh, Haryana. Many states uh, have been talking about it. Haryana has actually gone ahead with this quota in uh, private sector. Are you worried? And if so, why? Yes, I am uh, distinctly worried. I think the move goes against the basic principle of meritocracy that acts as the foundation for businesses to grow and remain competitive. And such protectionism, when clearly there are encouraging signs of economic recovery, hmm. would actually end up scaring employers, which will cost the state the much needed jobs now and also in the long run. And I'm definitely, I probably could have understood the motive and the intentions hmm. if it was a reaction to the pandemic and was a short term step. Yes. But the fact that it's been done for 10 years. The fact that it encompasses those employed up to 50,000, which is a very wide spectrum yes. of the youth. Um, I am distinctly worried because we have to acknowledge that till about two decades back, Haryana uh, was an economic wasteland. And um, there are organizations across the globe, uh, software companies decided to come down on Gurgaon. And it is what it is today. And it may not go well for the state okay. to treat uh, these organizations as hostages. I mean, it won't take much time for the software companies to move out, honestly. Manufacturing okay. might take longer, but not impossible. Right. Uh, Niranjan Hirandandani, you agree? Uh, I think we need to now think about not Haryana or Punjab or Maharashtra. We need to think about one India. You know, our workmen people go into Dubai and work. They work, they go to America and work. Mm. Uh, how are we talking about different states having issues? I can understand this for unskilled workmen. And I can understand unskilled workmen who are there, maybe much lower salary than 50,000, yeah. maybe 20,000 or something lower than that in yes. unskilled job. But the moment you go into skilled jobs, I just mentioned in terms of software and yes. other things, I think the criteria in terms of uh, how efficiency should work, because then the top end companies will slowly gravitate to other states. So I think uh, in the long run, it may not be good for Haryana itself. So, okay. Uh, the challenge, challenge is not the question of... Um, uh, uh, the question of giving jobs to the local, but mm. also seeing that in the long run, suppose some company wants to expand its business. Yes. They will then decide to choose other states. Then that way it will be to the detriment of Haryana. Of Haryana. So I oh. think personally Haryana needs to look at this. But I agree that at the local lowest level. There you can have uh, reservation. 